Welcome to the DIY3DTech.com channel. Welcome to this edition of DIY3DTech.com. In this edition, we're going to be looking at the unboxing and packaging of the Philbot.com ABS smoothing pen. So just uh, uh, actually, it ordered this from Amazon, and it uh, came today. So let's take a look at what's inside. I don't expect there'll be too much. Interesting. So uh, this is what was inside. Um, no instructions. Interesting that there's a couple marbles or what appear to be marbles inside the pen. Uh, I'm assuming what happens is this top is removed. It's kind of... Huh. The... Um, the top has a backwards thread on it, a reverse thread. So, kind of got to spin it backwards to remove. Um, and there seems to be some kind of spring mechanism inside here, which I assume it's for when you push on the tip that it allows, um, depresses the spring and allows ABS to, or sorry, acetone to um, infiltrate. Whoops, I keep going backwards. That's weird. Um, uh, you know, acetone. And then basically what you do is uh, take a part and then brush it on to the part to remove the striations and things like that. So I'll, I'll do a video on actually using it. I want to do an unboxing video for it and kind of show what it kind of looks like coming out of the package and what you can expect. I was sort of expecting at least a little... Um, pamphlet or something saying about the dangers of acetone and that kind of stuff and how to fill it um, but it just came in a regular u-line or yeah u-line package and this is what you get so I'm actually fairly interested um, to see there's some sort of uh, indentation on the bottom I'm not sure what this is for I like the fact that it does have a cover so this should stop any type of acetone smell from escaping and uh, I like the idea of using this to to touch up ABS parts um, and really kind of interested how it's going to work. So anyways, um, this is the unboxing. I'll put a link to this uh, below in the description if you're interested in it. And again, I'll be doing some follow-up videos on um, actually using it. Um, but I, I'm still not sure why the marbles in their acetone is usually is, is typically a very thin liquid so I'm not sure why one needs those in there uh, but we'll see we'll leave them in there anyways I'll give this video a thumbs up if it helped you out if you're interested in this um, if you have one of these you have comments hey please place them below I'd be interested to hear about them um, or any suggestions again please share below in the comments and we'll see you in the next video cheers